That's what happens. You, you come in and, and your dream house to retire and just relax. And then you have to fight coal companies because they just don't want to, they don't want to take their time and do it. They want to get it right now and run. My name's Dickie Judy and I live in Foster Holler in Boone County, West Virginia. Left hand fork. Well, they done a lot of damage uh, on the inside, uh, cracking the walls. Uh, they've done damage cracking ceramic tile. Shaking stuff off of the walls and hitting in the floor and breaking. Uh, done damage on the outside here. They've uh, cracked some walks. Uh, they're breaking the uh, stucco on the side of the block on the outside. And uh, they just keep harassing here about what they're doing with us, what little damage they're doing, and they do quite a bit. So uh, Mike Superfesky for the Federal said that this uh, was called the blasting all these places in my house. We moved in in. Uh, one month they done a pre-blast survey and they started blasting and they had a catalog on the pre-blast survey and we still got beaten court. Well, here, here's a crack too. This here is that, it's got the fiber in it and your concrete's not supposed to crack. And this slab's four and a half inches thick and it's cracked all the way through. All this here stucco is being busted off the house. Now these here had small cracks in them here as you see, but uh, they opened up, they've opened up quite large since they started blasting. Uh, this crack here wasn't even in here. Well you can see that corner there is broke. And it's busted up and down here and it's separated all the way across this. We let our house sit here a year before we finished it up and moved in it, I'd let us sit here a year, went in, cut out any kind of crooked studs or anything that was crooked in it, put new ones back in, put our sheet rock in, and, and then we moved in. And then they said this was caused by sadly, and after I sat here a year. Do you, they do, said, do you do construction, is that what you do? I used to for 11 years. I built homes for quite a few years. But uh, they put off shots here that, well, people call up here and ask if they's a plane wrecked or what blowed up up in here. And that's true. I mean, we got people shut up from over on Drawdy Mountain, which is uh, the way the crow would fly probably be six miles from the strip here. And vibrates their houses and, and said their wells are going bad. Now, I don't know about their wells, but you know, they said the house will rattle and shake, carry on, and they'll call over and ask what happened. See? Okay, now upstairs, right about here, I'll show you the problem in a doorway up there, one of them. Let's see, it's starting to crack here, bust all this open, see it? And then it comes up on the inside here. And these are solid headers. There's not, they're not just two before standing up. These are big solid headers with two by tens, half inch piece of plywood in between them. So it's built right. Uh, my wife was working there in the kitchen and the, uh, the fan globe fell out and hit the ceramic tile and cut her leg. Uh, pictures come off the walls. Uh, it last, yesterday they put off a shot about 1220. It knocked pictures off the wall, knocked some off of the uh, stands that were sitting there. Um, I couldn't tell exactly what all. My wife was telling me she was upset when she called me, so I don't know what all happened to it, but she was really scared. So it was a good shot. Uh, we've had pictures on the TV there, believe it or not, has fell off, vibrated when they put the shots off. I've washed this down three or four times. A, well, I'd say at least three or four times a year I had to push this house down because of dust coming from up at the strip. I mean, you can actually see it when they put off shots sometimes. You can sit out here and it'll all get cloudy and smoky back through here and then drift this way. So, they need to, they need some kind of laws to control it. You know, we're not environmentalists that want to fight out here on everything. We're just all we're trying to do is say that we need help with the laws of blasting, so the coal companies doesn't destroy people's property or any other blasting that's being done. If I would go up there and do the damage to that coal company that they've done to me, my butt would be in Crossbar Hotel right now, and the coal company'd be laughing. And now they've done a damage to me, and they're still laughing. 